हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू कोडिंग शिक्षा सो माय नेम इज गौतम एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट दैट हाउ टू रेंडर एच फाइल्स इन नोट जे सो यू कैन सी दैट दिस इज द इंडेक्स डॉट जे फाइल ऑफ नोट जे आई हैव ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड ए सर्वर बाय इंपोर्टिंग द एच मॉड्यूल एंड क्रिएटेड द सर्वर बाय दिस मेथड क्रिएट सर्वर इट टेक्स टू आर्गूमेंट्स रिक्वेस्ट एंड रिस्पॉन्स एंड आई हैव रेंडर्ड ए response of hello world and the content type is text slash plain and my server is running on this address so let me just show you this is the address you can see that if i refresh it the hello world response is rendered so what i need to do here is that i need to create a new index.html file and then i need to import that file into my node.js application so what can i do here so first of all let me just uh, create that file index.html so let me just write a basic html document title let me give hello world and the body let me create a paragraph element hello world and let me also put a heading of hello world to differentiate between the response and the index.html so this is our file we need to import it in index.js so for importing it first of all we need a module of a file system so we need to import that module so require function we will make sure so first of all we import this module of file server and after that we need to make use of a function just after you define your response here response dot right head after this line we will be making use of a function called as fs dot uh, read file you can see that this is a method this takes three arguments first is the path here the path is there in the same folder so i will mention here index.html the second argument is always null here so we need to set null here and the third argument will be the callback function if any kind of error take place or comma data so if, we, if any kind of error take place we will be making sure that we are ready for that situa situation so if error so if any kind of error take place we will be rendering the response here in this case of uh, right head so in this case i will pass here 40404 404, file not found error after that i will also response dot uh, right i can just pass if message that file not found that sort of a message if no error is found in that case we need to re define our response here response dot uh, write and we will be just writing the data that we are coming from you can see that there are two parameters error comma data so error in this case if any kind of error take place we will be making use of this variable that is error and secondly if don't if any kind if error is not taking place then we are successfully importing the index.html file and all the index.html is there in this data variable then we are just setting it in this response.write data so our response.end line we need to just delete this line from here so what we can do here is that we can just write this line just after this response.end we in this case we will not pass any kind of message here so that's all guys this is the whole code that is required in order to import a index.html file now i will stop the server once again control c and i will once again run this node index.js file so let me just refresh the page so you can see that guys uh, we don't want this it is working but it is just rendering out all the html that we have uh, uh, written in the index.html file we don't want this we want to 
uh, pass this HTML. So now what we can do here is that we need to just make a minor change in this. We need to content type. We need to just uh, change the header here. This is set to text plane. We need to just change to text HTML. So it will just parse this in the HTML code also. So control C again node index dot JS. So now if we uh, if I reload you will see that it is parsing the HTML successfully because we have changed the headers from text plane to text HTML. So that you can see that this is the paragraph and this is the heading that we have defined in the index.html file. So this is all guys. So if I make any kind of mistake here index.2html you can see that th there is no file name with this name. So I will get 404 error. So just show you the proof here. I need to restart once again. That is a very pain here. Node index JS. So now if I refresh, I will get the 404 error. So you can see that file not found because index2.html is not available. So that is guys very simple in order to import any kind of HTML file in your Node.js application. You write you want to write these lines of code. So thanks very much guys for watching this video. If you if you find this video useful, please hit the like button and also don't forget to subscribe the channel and I will be seeing you in the next video. Until then, thank you very much.